In this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to set up your email account in the Thunderbird email client. First go to the activities overview menu, then click on your Thunderbird icon. Now when Thunderbird first boots up it asks if you want to create a new email account or if you want to enter your existing. Of course we want to enter our existing. Go down here, click skip this and use my existing email. Do you want to reload contacts at startup? OK. Don't worry that that's blank, it'll be filled in later. Right, so put your details in here. I'm just going to use a temporary email that I've set up at Gmail. And passwords. Now Thunderbird will automatically query Gmail and get all the right settings back. And click done. Now before you click on your inbox to download all your mail, right click on your account. And go to synchronization and storage and untick keep messages for this account on this computer and the reason we do that is we don't need to download all of the content of all your emails to your Rinex stick um, because you can see what the emails are and then as you click on each one it'll only download the content for that which is nearly instantaneous so you don't need to waste all your bandwidth and storage by downloading all the messages click OK now click on the inbox it's going to jump off to Gmail and download all your mail and here it comes now there it is there and I also created a folder so it also pulls down any subfolders you create now the nice thing about putting your Gmail account in here is it's also going to synchronize all your contacts so first close your Thunderbird email and then reopen it and you'll see that down at the bottom of the Thunderbird window it'll jump off and go and ask, here it goes, ask Gmail for your contacts, batch synchronization, that was it. And so now if we click on address book and we go to our Google folder we can see I've only got one contact in there which was the demo one I made up but there it is there. This will bring in all your contacts and if you've categorized them on Gmail into family, friends and so forth it'll put them in all into those categories. I just noticed one thing um, to make things simpler Thunderbird is hiding the main menu but most of the time you do want to see it so just right click up here and then tick menu bar and now you can access all the different things in Thunderbird uh, Thunderbird is an extremely powerful email client uh, for Windows users. It's like having Outlook but not having to pay thousands of dollars for the Office suite. You've got your calendar, uh, you've got your normal email, you can have multiple accounts down here. If you go to Tools, you can see you've got stationery as well, and you can set up multiple stationery for each type of account. So if I want stationery for my Gmail or for my business account I can use different stationery in there. You can also go off and grab lots more add-ons um, that help Thunder, Thunderbird do lots of different things. Presently I've pre 